In recent news, Congress has made a significant decision that affects millions of Americans dependent on Social Security benefits. Amidst ongoing debates over federal spending and social welfare programs, a new development has emerged that promises relief for those in need. Good evening, and welcome to tonight's special report. Today, we delve into the latest decision made on Capitol Hill that's set to have a profound impact on the lives of many Americans. Congress has approved a measure that will raise spending limits, resulting in an additional $2,400 in monthly checks for individuals receiving Social Security Supplemental Security Income, SSI, and Social Security Disability Insurance, SSDI. Let's explore the details and implications of this significant development. This decision by Congress marks a crucial step in addressing the needs of some of our most vulnerable citizens. The increase in spending limits directly translates to tangible financial relief for individuals relying on SSI and SSDI benefits to make ends meet. It reflects a recognition of the challenges they face in covering basic expenses such as housing, healthcare, and daily necessities. For millions of Americans living with disabilities or facing financial hardship, Social Security benefits serve as a lifeline, providing essential support to meet their basic needs. However, stagnant benefit levels in recent years have left many struggling to keep pace with the rising cost of living. As the cost of housing, healthcare, and other essentials continues to escalate, the purchasing power of fixed-income individuals has diminished, creating a pressing need for action from policymakers. Advocates and activists have long called for an overhaul of the social welfare system to ensure that it adequately addresses the needs of those it serves. The decision to raise spending limits represents a significant victory for their efforts and underscores the importance of civic engagement in shaping policy outcomes. I've been relying on Social Security Disability Insurance for years due to a chronic medical condition that prevents me from working. The extra $2,400 a month will make a world of difference for me and others like me. It means being able to afford my medication without sacrificing other necessities like food or utilities. The announcement has been met with widespread relief and gratitude from beneficiaries and advocacy groups alike. Many see it as a testament to the power of collective action and a renewed commitment to ensuring economic security and dignity for all Americans. From an economic standpoint, increasing Social Security benefits not only provides immediate relief to those in need but also stimulates consumer spending, which can have positive ripple effects throughout the economy. By putting more money in the hands of individuals who are likely to spend it on essential goods and services, we can help bolster economic growth and stability.